the back next we pull up at the death loop here for the main circuit this will be the first track we come to in this gauntlet with a loopy loop but i do not think it will be the last but right first shot at the death loop not to be confused with the loop of death two very different things and we're gonna get the squeeze placed on us right here into turn one and climbed up by dick brooks please climb back down off of me thank you very much now side by side up these jump lanes that we never seem to have enough speed for but we'll be living as Terrio's really pinching me on this inside here. Terrio, if you would just move a little bit and we're going to get packed into the corner here all together, it won't really matter. We'll all get moved. So we're all just kind of bumping and grinding up against each other and I'm not even going to have a chance to go take the loop because it's just blocked the pack decided They're going this way. Get me to the inside. Everybody's missing the corner on the outside. You bunch of buffoons. It's a massive pileup. That's a wall. I'm going to take a look at where I'm going here. There's a bunch of tires and that's Austin Hill just plunging me into a tire check and then I get pummeled from behind a few more times we've already dented in just about every corner on this car please don't hit me again thank you and this this is great finishing the first lap is overrated the loop will save you millions of seconds oh newman newman just got us we just got rocketed by the rocket man right there we're gonna drive off oh craig alding just heat seeked him absolutely no chance of survival just amputated a wheel right off him with one big hit. And we're gonna climb under some cars to get a haircut and lose the race to Natalie Decker. So let me survive this last intersection without bringing any more shame and disgrace to my family name, and we'll do it. Outside the top 10 is not gonna help, but I mean, you know, pretty on par for the first run of the day. Now, will they squeeze us into turn one? Is that even a question? There they go. Busher up into us. Anderson sideways in the middle of the track and hooking me into the fence. Get out of there. Oh, we're going to the other fence. There we go just went coast to coast and i'm stuck in the fence no we're away all right going up the loop making up all kinds of time losing positions that we will hopefully gain back right here up and oh, oh we're gonna land on austin Dario again cannot stay away from that guy just landed on him and regan gonna take a look at the inside nothing going there is there are some hits in the intersection and we might get a little run here on Cole Custer and Matt Kenseth as they break hard. And somebody's hitting the roof of their car on the wall over here. We'll give them a little extra clip as we go by. And I'm getting hooked again, this time by Cole Custer. And we'll go ahead on into the wall. See if we can sneak through a gap here. Give me the gap, please. Oh, we almost made it. We were so close. We clipped Junior Johnson. Poor guy. Oh, Matt Tiff now going to get the landing treatment. I'm sorry, that cold trickle car just looked like a beautiful landing pad I had to take advantage. And away, we actually made pretty good, but then Karma comes back and gets me, doesn't it? Every single time. Just as I was starting to mention, we got away with it. Across the line, we'll go. Final lap now underway. We can make up some of these spots, hopefully. Climb back into the top 10 or just get hooked across the nose of whoever that was. That's fantastic. Somebody help me turn around here. Thank you, Casey. Did I just lose a wheel off of that? I absolutely did, didn't I? Do I even dare look? There it is. It's all gone. I might as well just drive into whatever because our race is over. Rip all of us. Can we just get a clean getaway? That'd be nice for a change. Would, wouldn't it be if I did get jacked up in the first corner and quite fittingly victimized? But we do actually make it out. So I uh, can't do too much complaining about that. Can I? I can complain about this though. Gray Golden not giving me any space. We'll just see you later, Gray. How about that? Just not landing on anybody this time. Nicely done. The little mini pack to Natalie Decker there, but we'll all survive. Oh my God, maybe not. Dick Brooks, you absolute clown. Get the wig, the horn, and the shoes and go to Clownsville where you belong, sir. What in the hell was that? Junior, I'm very sorry. I had no say in this. I'm just minding my own business out here. You know how it goes. Jesus, people. Uh, not that it makes any difference to him. Just get me out of here already. It's like a real mess on the mini map up here. Everybody steer clear. Matt Tiff to the landing zone again. Poor Matt. We've landed on him again already in this race. See if we can get through this without pile driving somebody. We're gonna, we're gonna run it right into Ryan Newman. Blasted him. Another hellacious wreck for his collection. Final jump for the final. Oh, Kowicki and I though, we're gonna time it just right. As we lose the race, we simultaneously annihilate each other. Oh, here comes another one, and it's Austin Terrio again. Another one that I'm just joined at the hip with. Looking like SpongeBob and Squidward over here, and now I'm just limping it to the line. Oh, then I get ass packed into another dimension just for my trouble. 
and we're gonna have to gather it up again and limp it back to the line which we will successfully do but only to claim 17. so jump back in the replay booth here again and this time to see well dick brooks trying to take us out of the race right from the start and we climb over that ramp and we just get creamed right there and we run over junior johnson and off the ramp here we're gonna slam hard into the 95 that was matt tiff we're gonna do the exact same thing again this time to ryan newman and we put it right in the side of his roof and then alan kawicki and i doing a very similar act here on the other side of the track and what would it be without one more hit in the intersection and then, of course, we get ass-packed on our way to the finish line by a Jeff Gordon wannabe looking ass. Please no squeeze. Oh, they squeezed. They squeezed. And I'm getting Casey Kane by Casey Kane. He's using me as the wall to Casey Kane me. That was impressive. Every now and then, the Terminators bust out a new tactic, and it wows me. It actually kind of wows me, like climbing up my backside right there. And I think that was Casey Kane again. Hey, Casey Kane, how about you get off of me, bud? Ah, and there's another intersection hit for us to get spun around in the spin cycle, but keep it going. Oh, man, a bunch of guys getting planted right there in the intersection and some more coming in to pile into it. That is a tragic scene that we are going to go ahead and race away from right now and jump over a couple of cars, send it into the corner. Oh, and he's going to turn me. And we got hooked. Oh, man, this is going to be tight. Yep. Saw that coming from a mile away, but we're going to keep it moving. Is that kind of a save if I totally killed somebody in the intersection? Get out of the way. Why are we driving at two miles an hour? Out of the corner, they're coming flat. Well, I wish I could get gaps like that for that landing. I'm always flying into somebody. But I don't know. We're going to be running out of time here. It looks like Chase Briscoe, I think, is racing to that flag as we speak. And there he goes. So let's see. Can we get through the last intersection without getting murdered? We do but it will not add up to much here. We're going to get it to the line, send it into Matt Tiff there, and we will claim fifth and a piece of Matt Tiff's ass right at the end. Maybe the strat here is just to turn into the squeeze and anticipate it and kind of be one with it. And it's kind of working until it didn't, until we got stuffed into the wall, which I should have anticipated probably more than the squeeze, but we are alive and moving. The war machine keeps turning, so we shall move along. This is bad. <laughs> We're going to get lined up for the three wide squeeze of death. Guess that makes us the Lone Ranger here on the loop once again. Everybody getting stuck over there. No problem for me. I will happily make up the time and spots here and maybe jump over Mark Martin too. Get by him as well. Oh, back to piling him up over here again, I see. And that is going to allow us to take the lead right there. We slipped by a big one. We will come down the last straight on our side. This wasn't quite my plan. Come on. Thank you. Oh, and then we get ass packed by the new leader, Matt Tiff. We just threw away the lead on the last lap. Oh, my God. I will not allow for this. I will not allow for this. I almost just got cleaned out. Didn't have a choice in the matter, but we still... I got to hunt down four seconds of Matt Tiff. Three seconds of Matt Tiff. This is my only shot right here in the loop. Please give me my time back. This is... There he is. There he is. Come here, Matt. Come here. Matt, I know what I have to do, but I don't know if I have the strength to do it. Oh, he's going to dump it, and I'll finish you off. See you later, pal. He's getting green back there, and we're going to get to the line and steal. What a glorious dub. Oh, well, another dub, another trip to the replay booth here to see how we got it. And of course, this is dub number six here of this gauntlet 2.0. Making our way through it, but it wasn't easily earned was not easily earned we had to fight through it and get triple pounded as you see and we came up to the white flag hit the ramp just wrong as wrong as you can and got stuck on our side for far too long let me just get run clean through by matt tiff he probably drives off thinking he's got it covered but alas we come through in the final corner right before the intersection we dump him and then some cars coming through finish him off for us make sure he won't come back and we slide our way through the line here we are at the Pocono Speedway for race number seven here in our gauntlet. And this track's kind of tough. You got to have some speed here. You got to be able to control the car through the corners. The AI seem to be able to do that a lot better than we can. So going to have to hold that thing on the wall and hope to stay out of trouble. But I doubt it. Can we survive the run down into turn one? That is always the major question. This is not looking promising. Head on into the wall and smack into a series of barrel rolls back into the fence and just flopping around like a fish 
and just dead upside down in the water missing a wheel just a textbook horror crash here at pocono would you expect anything less gotta see this one to believe it pocono striking bright and early and we get just walloped and i don't know if that counts as space force but it was pretty close it's definitely a candidate gotta see this one from the track side view now as cars up into the fence we weren't the only car into that fence but we maybe weren't the best if you will as it just gets all crazy from a distance here see it as it comes at us one car getting up a couple of cars flipping over here in the front pack and then of course we come flying through and look at us just jump into our infield death here Let's see if we can get into the draft of Greg Sachs. I don't like being up on the high side Kurt Busch just gets destroyed and then I do too and we're backing our way into this big one and absolutely nothing that can be done about it we at least land back on the wheels I got that going for us you gotta take the small victories oh my jeez hold on to it hold on to it see being on the bottom finally finally worked and it paid off oh we gotta send it on the outside here there oh, i'm not the only one doing it and we just get smashed who is that flipping and over and and we've got nowhere to go we're on three wheels get in a run through that was close that one is gonna land yikes just another big one here at oh we're not done oh my god spare me please Secret to success is definitely staying down here on the bottom. Try not to get run over and let them all run themselves all the way on the top side. We can slip through beautifully. Oh, they're hitting their brakes. They're scared. I'm not scared. I ain't no punk. I'll slide it through there. Lay it on the wall. We'll get all the speed. Get the pack. Get the boost from Robbie there. But we're three wide. We're going around. We're dying. We might be living. We're going to get the pack coming right at us. We got to go. We got to go. Don't get hit. Oh, Robbie's pulling right out. Robbie's gonna wear one in the door brutally. And then we just get turned inside out by an atomic ass pack. And just smoked. Funding has cleared. We are in the Space Force. Well, Elon Musk, if you're watching, I instruct you to take lessons at uh, what just transpired here because this is how you get to the moon about as quickly and easily as you can. You can translate that to Mars as well. We gotta look at what happened to poor Robbie Lyons here. He pulls out on track just to get slammed directly in the door. Something you really do hate to see out there on the track. And we go crazy up in the air, up to the top of the hill line in the back. And then we'll have an angle of it coming right at us as a bunch of cars are wrecking. But then we come flying through the scene. We're not quite done yet because the army car is going to come through and he oh, he does a pretty crazy flip of his own there, too. Well, I said it was a clean start for us, but apparently not for Ryan Priest. He's gotten destroyed. What have you been up to, dude? And they're getting destroyed up here in front of us. Somebody's Casey Kading. I'm going to slide into him. I can't stop. We just oh, we just cleaned out Eric Almarola. Oh, no, that's not going to be good for that bad back. That is not going to help. This is not going to help these guys. This is it's the world's longest ass pack. Oh, the turning is not there, and there goes the wheel. Damn this thing. This is harder than it looks. Ah, uh, we're going to be right in the line. I ho I welcome somebody to come pack me, and there it is. You could just feel that one coming in the minimap. May have given you a clue as well, but I'm just going to act like that was Spidey sense. And I got the outcome I desired anyway, so that will be that. Oh. Come on, we can, this is where we gain our time. If I put it on the wall, I'll gain more, but it's so... Oh, that's almost... See, I was going to say, I don't want to cheese it like that, and then I wreck myself trying to do it the right way. I'm just going to start planting it on the wall. I'm going to take myself out of this thing because we're going over the fence. I might take myself out a little too much here. But we're still in the racing lane, and there comes Jeff Gordon's car to just clear us out. We're getting hit in the air. We're getting hit in the air by cars in the air. And they're coming. Oh, God, we're not done. There it is coming by us too wide for no good reason people slow down just a little bit it doesn't end and we're dead now it's over oh my god oh the apron's not that's that's too low that's officially too low somebody just got up on the top of the fence like we did oh don't climb up these guys hold it and i just get sent absolutely sent. we just barely dodged the tire check we're we're just flying backwards through the infield now all right 
This is our life now. Cool. Just keeping it low, but uh, I hate getting dead on that apron. It just costs us too much momentum. Just keep it low and don't die, please. Let's get a run here on Andretti. The record in front of us. So oh, where are they going to go? We're getting clipped. Oh, somebody just obliterated the tires on the inside wall there. We're getting a push from Jeff Gordon in the Jeff Gordon car. This is a flawless start. Until I'm until I pack it into Sam Mayer. That is a bit of a setback. But besides that, this has been tremendous. Jeff Gordon tried to get on my outside and thought better of it. Can we send it on Sammy here? Yes, we will, or at least try two or three wide. Somebody said it even harder than I did on the outside. It didn't work, and that might have helped us because we are clear. Send it. That is maybe too much of a send. Save me, Wall. Thank you, Wall. We're into third. Oh, Kowicki just laying smash in the street back there. We got another one up here. Jeff Gordon of the Mighty have fallen, and the leaders are all wadding them up, and we are the leader now. You love to see it. With one last slap of the wall and one last corner, we are going to come through to the dub. This one was all about survival, it seemed. Didn't take us too many tries, but we got ourselves dub number seven. We're jumping right into round number eight here of the Gauntlet 2.0. We are here at the legendary Stockton 99 Speedway, one of the all-time classic tracks here in Wreckfest. For the first time, but not necessarily the last time here in this Gauntlet, we got to deal with the figure eight with ramps here first. So let's get right to it. Let's go get us one. We already put it in the back of Bonnet a little bit there. Excuse me while I make a lane for myself on the outside and we nose dive in hard. These cars love to do that, especially here. Kurt Busch is just getting carried by Brennan Poole. That's very interesting. That cleared us some space. That'll help. We're going to take the intersection jump. Everybody's nose diving though, and we're going to pile into it and slam through. Land on the wheels at least, but what is that? This is going to be a tight intersection here, and we've been sentenced to a blasting. And down on the barrier we go. Get me off of it. Oh, landed Castle down hard and deep. Oh, more intersection hits. So oh, we're lining up for one of our own again with Neil Bonnet and landing down on the nose of Bobby Isaac. Michael Annette set himself up for a mounting of sorts. That's a disgraceful ass pack. Oh, there's no, there's no way. There's absolutely no chance of us surviving that one. Well, we can maybe drive away. Oh, no. Oh, oh, Brennan Poole, no. No, down on my head. Squished. We look like we got bumped. There's actually a 0% chance of getting through the intersection cleanly at this place. It's just not possible without getting twisted up. And we landed on Norm Benning right there. We're going to get landed on ourselves. I didn't even see who that was, but they came right at us like a Tomahawk missile. And now I'm just getting carried around. Come on, guys. Norm, could you help me spin around somebody? Please just flip somebody over. Brett Moffat nearly went over, but we had to do it ourselves. This is too big of a pack right here. That was just destined to be destruction. Bobby Isaac gets the win. Coming back from us, just flattened him like a pancake earlier. And look at us. Look at the state of us. And looking at us, I've caused me to miss the corner a little bit. Oh, this is a great way to... Yeah. Oh, nice. Well, can't say I didn't deserve that one. That is totally and utterly fair. But I, I've just cost myself a probably abysmal amount of spots that I think I'm about to get back completely and utterly instantly. This might be the most disgusting last lap you will ever see in the history of humanity's racing efforts. But we're going to come through and at least get to the finish line, which is somewhat of an accomplishment. Oh, Neil, 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 I'm sorry. Oh my god, that is a literal, by definition, pileup right there. Does not get any more classic than that. Get me out of here. Oh, the nose diving, the nose diving. I can feel it. Oh, the nose, and we're gonna get landed on. Oh, we get kind of punted there in the, right in the wheel, and this is, well, this is not where I wanna be. Let's go ahead and hit that reset and get the hell out of here once again. Sorry, 82 Casey Mears landing. Oh, Casey, are you gonna miss the corner? Absolutely. Oh, and then we get the Doris Karma. You know what, that's only fair. It's only fair that I get ruined for doing some ruining as there's a lot going on behind me. Oh, Brett Moffat with a little slide job. I see you, Brett. I see this nose dive too, and I'm sick of it. I've had about enough. Oh, this, I, here comes the pile. And I just lost the wheel, I think. 
You gotta be kidding me. Well, there's that one. Uh, pretty much done and sorted then. All right, you guys just want to come run through me? Is that how we're gonna end this one? Just with everybody running into me? Because using the steering wheel to move in any other direction is really that hard. Oh, yes, just dispose of me like trash at the side of the road, please. I welcome it. Oh, Timmy! We clipped Timmy Hill. The legend himself. And we are going for a ride. We almost rode out of that. Until Ricky Craven turned me. This is not the last lap at Darlington, Ricky. This is not necessary. And we just got to get out of this mess. That is all that is. Dick Brooks going to slide it in there. We're going to get lined up for the big shot. And just shattered. As we're landed on by Michael Waltrip. He's upside down. He's turtled. And I'm stuck. Oh, we got danger detected here. We're going to slide just underneath, but we're going to dive in. Of course, we had to dig in. We're not allowed to have a successful landing that is in the rule book. I can't even turn around correctly at this point. Oh, a big midair hit there, and another one followed up. Oh, land it. Come on, land it. There we go. Count it. That better count. Oh, just another big old smash him up in the intersection. And we're going to land on Michael Annette right in the head. Get in, in his brain. Oh, look at this. Brendan Poole just getting in the way for no good reason. Just lap down cars getting in the way. LePage and themselves were across the line, but not without one last swing from a Dale Doncic car. And we're in 12th. Oh, we're going to push Timmy Hill wide. He's in the tires. The most solid of tire checks, and we got a bumper check here as well. We got a frame check. Give me a consciousness check. Oh, David Ruderman just says, I'll be getting out of the way. You two have fun, and I'm going to get right up Christopher Bell's ass. And we send it into a pile and craft it up on top of us in even more. Castle, Kurt, Push, Mears, they're all flying. They're going to keep flying in. This is the gargantuan one. Here, look at the size of this catch here. We got fresh fish all over the place. And they're still coming. I just want to sit here and watch this. Oh, here comes another one. Oh, and right in the tire. That was Christopher Bell. And he knocked my wheel off. That's revenge. Oh, it literally came full circle. Oh, we're going to get it. Yep, right up the backside of another one. This has just never panned out once ever. Never find it on record, please. Oh, Dale. Sorry. Into the spin cycle we go. We actually gotta roll that out. Please don't get landed on the oh the shadows. I can see it coming. Get me out of here. We just dodged a couple of them flipping around us. Ruben gonna shove me in the wall a little bit there. It's the king. What's up, King? Oh, King's taking somebody out. Oh, we just punched somebody in the mouth. We're gonna get landed on oh, somebody just Casey Mir just flew over us. Oh no, me and Norm! No, Norm Benning and I come together for a thunderous impact, and we got a turtle. Oh, that's a massive pack going over. Look at the new. Got to use the old monitor to swing. Man, Paul Menard just sent it. That was beautiful. The just majesticness of Paul Menard flying over the pack. So I'll tell my grandchildren. Of, oh, I won't tell them about this, though. This is not good. It's coming through it backwards. Maybe I will tell them about it after all. Nor Benning's chasing me down. It's like a nightmare. Back it up and let's go. Come on. Oh, who's that taking swipes at me? I know that was a Michael Wall grip. And into the spin cycle we go and taking the L as we do it. Bobby Isaac coming through just to ruin my day. We're so close. Uh, bouncing over the tires. Got the king laps down. We're going to come home in what looks to be a pretty disgusting and hard earned fourth place fit. Neil's doing a wheelie. BJ McLeod turning that thing all the way around and getting stuck on us. Come on, let me free you jerks, all of you bums. Oh, Christopher Bell giving a little shot to Norm. We're all getting shots and we're all going to pay for it. Everybody got a shot from everybody and we're stuck again. Oh, man, we just creamed whoever that was and down on the roof doing spins and pirouettes and getting spinned and pirouetted on. Oh, no, we've been desecrated once again. Oh, there's another one right in front of us and another one for us to trip over as well. And down hard on the suspension. That's not going to be good for the spine. And another one doesn't end. Just turned into a torpedo. Can it please be one? Nope. No, 
I thought we were gonna maybe just skim over top of them, but we could never. There was never that as an option, was there? This is sad. Is this a clean one? Nope. Not with this landing pad sitting around. Looks like a bunch of people just stomped on my car. And the front end of it's an open wheel car now too, which is the regulations. The tent is not gonna be happy about this. That's what I know. We're gonna get DQ'd so hard. Oh, three wide. This is, this is how the money is made. We're, oh, what a, what a clearing. Oh no, don't do it, BJ. <laughs> Buddy, that, there you go. All right, have fun over there. Land it, land, land, no, oh, land it. Back it up, back it up. Don't worry, Captain, we will buff out those scratches. We're close to the lead, but there's just, we're not gonna get there if this keeps happening to us. This must stop. I, I, I demand it cease. Stop it. I just wanna get up there to Bull Menard. Mike Lynette wants me dead, and he's not the only one. Just give me a round. Oh, getting squeezed left, right, center. I don't want anybody touching me right now. Get away from me. Go cough on someone else. I am asking for dastardly things to happen to Brett Moffat right now. I need the assistance, and there it is. And there's, there's a swift serving of justice for myself as well, just for asking for it. But we're going to get away here with a bit of a lead if we don't throw it away. We are the leader. And out of the final corner, we're gonna head into the last crossing. Will we get nailed? No, we do not. It's a clean finish to collect dub number eight. It was delivered upon request. As we watch the replays, I can tell you what, I wish I had one of those Dodge Rams that's sitting around this track. That'd be a lot more helpful. There's just a common theme in these replays of us getting landed on and twisted. And just more twistage and tossage and I just, I don't know, getting landed on. Here's some more. Yeah, this could be great. And then oh, just another ob obliteration of us. But we actually took the lead right there. That was a race winning move you just saw. As we roll into round number nine of our gauntlet, we come up on another one of the all time classics the slow, the fast, and the stupid, but better known to us as the Hot Wheels track. And it is going to be one of the tougher ones we're probably going to face. So let's not waste any more time and get right to it. Off we go. First run of the round. Do we expect to get our will absolutely crushed down here? I anticipate it because we don't even need to get to the first corner usually. And there it is. That was just mandatory, wasn't it? An actual requirement of continuation and down to the abyss we go with three wheels. Give us good luck on the other side though. That's all we can ask. Oh, there was a bit of a hole, but it closed up. If it was ever really open at Kyle Busch, flies over the edge of the earth into the abyss. Oh yes, give me that run off the high side here. Let's make the jump and get big beefy bounces even on the landing. But we do land it. And we landed it into second too. So if you can survive the start, generally you'll be all right. Usually, sometimes. Oh, we're gonna fly over the top of Austin. And this is where things usually get in. Oh, and I'm gassing a little too hard. We're going off the side. And we got saved by the pillar. I thought we lost the wheel there for a second, but we just beat the crap out of it. And back to second we go, but maybe not for long. Austin's throwing it away and off the side of the world he goes. He's got more of them going off the side here. And I'm gonna do it myself. Damn it. Please don't lose a wheel. I and almost on cue. The wheel comes flying off. Oh, this is gonna be tight three wide. Brandon Jones just got killed. And we're shoving Newman out of the way. Give us that high side run again. Norm, don't squeeze me, please. Let's get through this. Oh my God, big time contact in the intersection and I'm gonna wreck myself. I've never seen something like that before. That was awesome. Oh, we got one stopped up here. Give me that position, Kyle Petty. We get by him and now we have got our sights on Matt Tift for the glorious lead of this race. Can we get by it? Oh, he takes himself entirely out of it. It's just, and off the side goes the car behind him of Kyle Petty. And we're gonna bounce off the fencing. Oh no. Oh, thank goodness we bounced off the other side. We might ride out of this. What a display of skill and talent. Get the speed, dodge the pins. Oh, that's not dodging the pins. Stay on the track. Please stay on the track. Oh my God, I don't need this. Oh, 
Oh, bottoming out, don't you? Oh, why? Damn it. You gotta pick a lane here. You gotta dive in this hole. It closed. It immediately closed, and then we're just getting carried along. Somehow, we've stayed on the racing track once again. That's nice. Can we get turned around on said track? That will be the real question we do. After <laughs> a little bit of harassment, we get through it. Oh, Mark, what are you doing? Mark Crab walking all the way through it. And we're gonna try by a bunch of guys here, getting all kinds of spots. Well, the sounds of being in the air is kind of creepy. Somebody's losing it up here. Is that Tiny? Who's that? Tiny indeed is out of shape. Oh, we're in the lead. I don't know who, I don't know who blew it, but we took the lead right there. I didn't even see anybody. Oh boy, what am I doing? What am I actually doing with my life? Why did I do this? Why didn't I hit the brakes? Please don't destroy the car. Why do I even say these things? It's like guaranteed that the opposite of what I asked for is going to happen. And our race is shot. Just like that. Give me the lane. They did. And then the lane got clogged. As is tradition. Oh, and then packed while I'm on my side. And we're going to be in turtle mode. Maybe not for long. Back on the wheels. Can we get flat? Maybe, maybe not. Yes, we do. Don't close up. And we're off. Oh, this is going to go well. Somebody's laying dead in the street. Hit the brakes. How are we going to get through it? Oh, no. What am I? This is a little bit too much air for my comfort right here. Down hard on the old spinal cord. Just fused a few vertebrae. No big deal. I should slow down for this. Why? Wow, you. Ah, we bottomed out and we're dead. That that figures. You might swerve in. You swerve in urban if you don't give me a little room and we just pack somebody in instead. And down we go through the secret floor. And I guess this is supposed to be the seafloor, and I am an urchin of some kind. You tell though, this is not going to be good. There was no gap, and they squeezed me up, and around we go, and off the side. Back to back, fallings off the map, and then I get T-boned while I'm underneath. I can get T-boned anywhere on this map if I try hard enough. We'll see what it looks like when I get absolutely just annihilated here and tossed up into the air, and I wasn't the only one. But I certainly fell to a rather untimely death, and... Looks like everybody else kind of sorted it out. What a bunch of bums. Let's see if we can not get hooked. I did, and we're just gonna add to this pile. Just crumpled up. Let's get the reset and blocked. Just thanks, boy. And it was Morgan Shepard, the roller skating legend himself. Ryan Newman and Harvick taking themselves out for no good reason. What in the hell? Casey, you're going the wrong way, dude. Now you got me going the wrong way. Look what you've done. Oh, we're falling into the abyss. And we lost the wheel. I cannot believe what I'm seeing. Just spare us somewhat, please. Nope. Not a chance. Back into the twister. Oh, man. Oh, man. I can't even keep it straight. We're not going to make it. We're taking cars out. Oh, we're getting blasted. We're going back the other way. Oh, my God. We just got destroyed. From multiple angles. Okay, let's not bottom out this time. Hey, see, he learns sometimes. And Johnny Benson apparently is just dead somewhere over here. We're going to take the lead from him, even though I didn't see anything resembling Johnny Benson or a car. So, cool. But can I get through? Oh, no, please. No, no. And there we are. Damn to spend another season in the abyss. As we fall over as we're dancing on the pole down here. Can I file in behind Bowman? No, the hole's taken up. The gap is there. We space for somebody. I don't know who that is, but we just, we just rocket boosted him. Oh, this thing's not driving so good. It's bouncing. I think the suspension has seen enough, and apparently that guy's seen enough of me, and back into the abyss I go. Oh, God. Gonna, oh I barely almost squeezed through there. Oh, I was thinking that was going to be the coolest thing ever, and it almost was, and it's going to turn into another trip to everybody's favorite wintertime vacation spot, The Abyss. 
And I don't quite know what this guy is trying to do, but he's not doing it. Give me victory or give me the death. I've been given the death. As is tradition. And sometimes you just gotta take that death and take it. We shall. Let me get out of the way of a bunch of you maniacs. Kevin Harvick said doesn't matter. Just gonna run right through you and he gets run through himself. And that, my friends, is a lesson in racing scumbaggery and slime ballery. Oh, we got another maniac going backwards. It's Mark Martin. One of the OG haters and terminators of our Wreckfest career has sabotaged us. Oh, come on. Keep it straight. Keep the power. We're not making it. We just got my head chopped off by that thing. Oh, who dis? Who dead? Bobby Allison. We'll take the spot. Oh, not this again. You got to be kidding me. And then I get, then I just get packed to death. He did. Bobby just piled it in and killed me, didn't he? I don't expect anything less from this track, though. We're just getting the beat down that we probably rightfully deserve, and we just kind of slide into this one kind of gracefully, almost, if you will. I got to get Jeff Burton off of me, and I'll get out of here in reverse if I have to. If it comes down to it, but Ryan Newman's going to see that it takes a little bit longer. And I thank him for that. We'll go this way for a change. Oh, you guys are really getting... Oh, another one! Another one! Morgan Shepard, roller skater boy, actually brings an end to my existence. Finally. After years of trying, after years of frustration. Oh my god, it, oh, it almost worked! It almost worked! If that had worked, I would have shut the game off. The gauntlet would be over. It would have had to end right then and there. Oh, man. All right, you can't you can't deny that was amazing. If you made it this far, you got to hit the like button for that. I don't know how far we're even in. As there is the big one. That was a massive one. In an unusual spot for one. And hit the big beefy bounces here. David Reagan just said, see, he's going off the side of the world and we'll take the spot. We can navigate these pins. We might be making a big moment here. We take the lead. Going into the corner here. This is our race to lose. If we can get this lap in the books, the final lap is underway. We get through clean. One more problem area to navigate. I probably got, oh, I really got too much speed for this one. <laughs> I swear I don't do this stuff on purpose. I really promise. I think we're all right. We've got four wheels. We got a 16 million year lead over Johnny Benson in second. So as we send it down the final straight, I think it's safe to say we can send it off the final straight and collect the glorious dub number nine. Well, slowly but surely, we are starting to make our way through this gauntlet and collect ourselves dubs like Thanos and Infinity Stones. We're making them jealous out here. Forget all those Infinity Stones. We're collecting dub after dub after dub, but it wasn't easy. As you saw, we get beat up at the start. Then we had all kind of action up here in these cross jumps that you have to try and get over the crazy amount of cars that either don't make it or have to double jump some of these guys just get absolutely destroyed and they get set on wild rides like these guys right here there they go it's fun to just kind of sit here and watch these fools honestly well we roll into round number 10 next and just when you thought you've seen enough of us getting beat down we roll into hell ride of all places oh lord not sure I'm emotionally ready for this, but off we go with the L ride. And I better get emotionally ready because we're only at round 10 of 25, so it's only going to go downhill from here pretty much. And this, this could go downhill very fast, and it does as we all pile up at the hoop. The flaming hoop caught us all. R.I.P. Oh, I don't like it. They're coming at us from all sides, and you couldn't move over, man. Really? You have to leave the space. Let me get off to the side a little bit here so I can avoid the oncoming death that's coming close to us and we just barely squeak by it. See if we can get by it again here on the exit. Nope, that was tightened up and there was no way up in the air. Getting creamed again from all sides and barrel rolling. Come on, we'll spin it out of there if you have to. Somebody's flipping up into the hoop up there. Wild rides being seen everywhere. We're just flying by. I'm taking the spots. Tire check. Don't slide on me too much. I can't see. I can see Natalie Tecker coming right at me, and we get launched ourselves immediately after. 
Let me recover this thing here. We're able to keep the lead. Oh, no, Rusty. Damn, I thought maybe I could just slide by on the outside, but Rusty and I barely touched corners there. Oh my God, somebody just let it all air out there. Cars flying everywhere. I'm gonna put it into the back of Sam Mayer, throw him into a front flip. I can't imagine a much worse place to be stuck than on this ramp and AJ Obendinger, I think it was, just took the hit for us and cleared the lane and we're going to the wall. No, tire check. And we lost an entire wheel. I'm not giving up though. I'm not, maybe I should give up. I think I just nailed, I think that's Brian Vickers and I'm trying to turn around and Natalie Decker's gonna take the lead back from us, damn it. Get out of the way. Oh my God, as if this hasn't been exaggerated enough. This is tremendous, just with an exceptional series of flips right there. And can we lose a few more spots before I can drag my corpse across the line? Is this guy just gonna run into me? Apparently we are. I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose second place here. Damn you people. Damn every single last one of you to hell. Well, the bottom is the best place to be to get spared. So I think that's just what we're gonna stick with for now, unless Kevin Conway gets himself lodged in our path. And then we'll just get crumpled up like a piece of used napkin and discarded like trash. Oh, Wendell. Hang in there, we ran down just enough for me to get smacked. And the pummeling is just gonna keep on coming, isn't it? Come on, get a Juan Pablo Montoya underneath me. I am not a jet dryer. Please get away from me. And here come a bunch more. Let me on thy wheels. At least let me get out of here or try to. Oh, we got one flipping up here. We got, holy crap, how did we fit through the gap? Only to get torpedoed in the very next corner. And there goes one of our extremely crucial and valuable wheels. To the underside we go again. Oh, we didn't even get a chance to make it there. Just dumped and flung. Like, well, like Kurt Busch once said, like a booger. Where are you gonna go, Rusty? Oh, where are you gonna, oh, he's gonna go take a man out. And we're going for a ride. Oh, we almost rode out of that. That would have been some sick Hot Wheels stuff right there if we could have drove off of that and we take a drive right to the rear wheel. We gotta hunt down Tony Stewart too, which is what I'm most scared of and me about wrecking the cars. Whoa, not gonna help, but then we get in with some spinners. Well, that takes Tony out of the equation, but we're gonna go hunt down Justin Haley. Now we'll drive underneath him for the lead. And then we lose it immediately, but my God, we've driven over guys for the lead and now under them for the lead. And there we take it once again for Rusty, only to pile into a couple more cars. Can we keep it moving? No, we cannot. It's illegal. Punishable by death even. But eyes on the podium, eyes on this car coming right at me, Rusty. Coming to take me out. And he was nearly successful, that hurt. That cost us spots. This is causing chaos in front of us and we just went mouth to mouth with somebody coming over the other side of the ramp. And there's another spin cycle for us to enter. And down hard on the roof we go. I feel like Speed Racer driving around this thing. I'm gonna drag race with Glenwood and he's got nowhere to go. Just decked Natalie Decker. This thing's really limping, man. I gotta get it. Oh, watch out. You gotta get it to like balance on that back wheel or else it won't go. Just gotta keep flicking the wheel. I'm trying to stay out of the way. It's harder than it looks. And oh, we might be dead in the water. My car does not want to do very much moving. She may have had enough and we've got one heat seeking us right here. It's Davey Allison. Just came in from miles down the road to deliver that one. Thank you, Davey. Appreciate you. This is becoming the wrong side of the track to be on to avoid death and there's more of it out of my windshield. We hit Kevin Conway in the head. We keep on going with a tire check and a cone check and I'm wearing a tire as a hat. I throw it off to the side. And speaking of getting thrown off to the side, a bunch of cars are going to be doing that as well as myself. And we've lined it up with Davey Allison here. Let's get it off of this hill, please. I hate this part of the track. Sheesh. I'm just following these guys with faith here. Hopefully we can get a nice landing. Am I land on Tony Stewart? We do. Landing on the door, crunched his head in a little bit. We got a race here now inside the top five. Taking it to the outside here, get that momentum up, get that speed, get by Tony. We're splitting cars in the middle. 
while we're racing and we're gonna take the lead on the outside it's working oh god i got cars coming at me head on from a bunch of directions please somebody wipe me out here man that was close the cars coming over just in time and we're clear the lead is great oh quickie coming out of nowhere pummels me in the face get me through here cleanly please oh my god we're jumping in between cars how is this working oh cars coming at us here find the gap the gap has closed it's gone it may have never been there there was a little bit of daylight there but not a chance here is all oh, we got one falling off the side of the hill and we're getting pummeled now oh on every side getting even hits on every corner of the car just if you will victimized out here and this is not gonna go well as we go over on the roof and we got Harrison Burton to knock us back over we are bleeding time we gotta go we are we cannot afford to be lollygagging out here we have got to go we have got to stay away from the banked wood this is not helping me we're down to half a second we're losing all of our time we've lost the lead come on car we pick a gear and get into it let's go we gotta pick one. Neil Bonnet is driving away from me. Juan Pablo Montoya, I'm wearing him as a hat now. Oh, this has gone just as badly as it can. We've lost the wheel. Morale's looking like it's at an all-time low. I will drag this thing to the finish line if I have to, though. Even though I've lost to Brian Vickers, now I'm just gonna cause problems and havoc and ruckus badly. Home stretch. Okay, Sam Mayer. All right, buddy. How do you like that head-on hit? And you're out of the race. He took himself out the 500 IQ big brain maneuver. It was made. And it got us inside the top five. I will take it. I don't even know that I could take the ram if I wanted to. I can't. They blocked and hooked me. That Tony Stewart's pushing me. I'm packing walls ass first. And now I'm stuck on the banking. Let's get this thing turned around. Oh, got to make evasive actions over the banking. And back on my roof. Turtled in my favorite section of the track once again. Oh, here we go. Another one. A repeat. Can't even get through here the second time. That is just fantastic. Phenomenal. Ah, oh, come on. We can do it. Turn around. I'll put it up on the wall to get that speed boost. Don't bother me. That better not have been my wheel. It was. Of course it was, what it fell off for, I have no idea. That was not an honorable reason. I don't believe, and there's a hit. As God forbid that car moved over two inches. That would have been a problem. That would have just been inoperable. And that guy just got smoked. Got so much speed, but I can't turn. I cannot turn. And Kevin Conway's right in the way, and we just use all of our energy taking him out. Oh, hey, hey, look, actual race cars that are capable of racing each other. Don't mind me just wasting away over here. Oh, man, we got one getting blasted up and over, and a couple of them do. Oh, wow, that was a close. That might, <laughs> that one might have finished us off right there had we gotten hit. It's almost a shame it didn't happen. That's too bad. Oh, Cousin Carl in the way. I was home free, dude. Oh my god, the amount of hatred coursing through my veins right now is incredible. And I don't think I can move from here now. Me! No chance at the ramp once again, it seems. So we'll try to survive underneath. And maybe make it to the lead. What a run! Use the ramp this time. Here we don't get smacked before getting a chance to. And off we go, sailing it through there. That was a massive... Oh, make a turn here. What the hell am I doing? I am actually an idiot, but we're all right. Big drifts only. Oh, it's too much. That's all. Oh, I've overcooked that right into somebody. Somebody I'm probably racing and giving up a lot of time to. And another one. Another one. Just what I needed. Please, everybody stop hitting me. I'm losing all kinds of time and I'm gaining it back. I'm just going to keep it pegged to the floor no matter what happens and who pulls out on me like Cole Wiki there. Come on, dude. It's like they know I'm coming and there goes my lead, AJ. Come here, AJ. Come on, buddy. Here, kitty, kitty. I'll do you like Tony Stewart used to do him. I will. Come on, ba oh boy. Oh, get heat secret, pal. Get terminated. How does it feel? On the final lap. 
It's drama time as we're just gonna get smacked by everybody now, aren't we? Am I stuck? I'm stuck and I'm not done getting hit. And this is now, this is a race again. This is a race again. AJ just got pummeled. Tony Stewart's back in the race. I'm getting hit by Brian Vickers. We gotta go. We can't be getting hit like this. Get out of the way, everybody. Get out, stop, stop. Damn it, all of you, this was our chance. No, I need super speed. Oh, I don't need this. This is the last thing I needed. I need a nitrous bottle at this point. I, I need some kind of alien technology, seemingly the only place I'm gonna be able to catch up. And they're all crashing here at the finish line, it looks like. Is Tony Stewart out of the, wait a minute, what just happened? You guys said we're home free. What did they do? They just handed the win back to me for no reason. Look at Brian Vickers. What happened to him? Briscoe's over here with exactly one point of health and he's gone. And we get to dub. We collect the 10th ring. Back to the replay booth we go. This was an unlikely win round. I thought for sure we were dead in the water on this one. But somehow, some way, they managed to destroy themselves, and I want to go see how they did that exactly. But we were destroying ourselves too, and we take the lead here from AJ Allmendinger, and then we get into an entire series of problems on the other side of this ramp, where we get hit by what it, it must have been at least thirty to forty-five thousand cars that hit us uh, over here on this side of the ramp. Once we settled in here, as you'll see, as you. Watch, they come in from just about every direction, every angle, and for every reason, they want to beat us down. And then we have here Tony Stewart's view of things, so we want to watch him, because you'll see, he gets, he does get taken out and cost time, and that is how we were able to catch up to him, because he recovers from this wreck, and then will drive down here only to get into another one. And we are able to use this to our advantage, and I didn't really see this happening, because I figured they'd get through the last two corners clean and there we go to take the lead. So it counts the same as the rest of them. We got 10 in the books.